Welcome to System Initiative. This tutorial will teach you how to use System Initiative to model your infrastructure. We will be deploying a single free tier EC2 instance in AWS and cleaning it up. There should be no cost to you. To follow along, you'll need three things. First, start by signing up for System Initiative. Next, you'll need an AWS account that allows you to create free tier resources, such as EC2 instances. And last, your System Initiative workspace should be open in another window. Let's start by creating a change set. First, click the Change Set button. Then, name your change set, Getting Started, and click the Create Change Set button. To add an AWS credential to the workspace, click the AWS credential component in the Asset palette and drop it onto the Canvas diagram. This creates a new credential component. Once the credential is on the canvas, resize it until it fills most of the visible canvas by dragging the lower right corner of the frame. Now you want to name your newly created component. Click on the AWS credential you just added to the canvas. The panel on the right side of your screen will show that it has a default name of SI2514. Change the name to be Tutorial. Hitting Enter will update the diagram with the new name. Now it's time to configure a secret. Click the Select Add Secret button next to the AWS credential property, then click Add Secret. Name your secret tutorial secret. Fill in your AWS account's access key ID and secret access key. Refer to the AWS documentation if you do not know what they are. Click Store Secret to securely encrypt and save your secret. It's time to configure the region our infrastructure will be running in. Click on the region in the Asset palette and drop it inside your Tutorial Credential Frame. Resize the region to fill the space inside the Tutorial Credential Frame. Name your region Ohio and set the region property to US East 2. Click on the key pair from the AWS EC2 category of the Asset Palette and drop it inside your Ohio region frame. Name your key pair SI Tutorial. Set the key name property to SI Tutorial. Click on the EC2 instance from the AWS EC2 category of the Asset Palette and drop it inside your Ohio region frame. Name your EC2 instance SI Tutorial. Set the instance type property to T2.micro. Click the key name output socket of your SI tutorial key pair and connect it to the key name input socket of your new EC2 instance component by dragging the line between them. Click on the AMI from the AWS EC2 category of the asset palette and drop it inside your Ohio region frame. Name your AMI Fedora Core OS. Set the image ID property to as shown. Connect the image ID output socket of your AMI component to the image ID input socket of your EC2 instance component. Press the escape key or click on the background of the canvas to ensure the workspace itself is selected. You will see two actions enqueued in the right hand panel, one to create the key pair and the other to create your EC2 instance. Press the apply change set button. You'll be prompted with a dialog to confirm you want to take these two actions. Press the Apply Changes button in the dialog to confirm.
Applying the change set redirects you to the head change set and enqueues your actions. The proposed changes panel on the right side of the screen shows your two pending actions. As the actions are run on AWS, their resulting resources are added to each model. As this happens, the actions will disappear from the proposed changes list. Once both actions have been run, you'll see some confetti, and the changes panel will be empty. Congratulations! You have created your first resources with System Initiative. Select the SI Tutorial EC2 instance. Then select the Resource subpanel on the right side panel. You will see all the information about the EC2 instance we created in AWS. Create a new change set called Cleanup. Select the Tutorial AWS Credential component. Press the Delete key. You'll be presented with a dialog confirming you want to delete the components we created previously. Click Confirm. Press the Escape key or click on the canvas background to select the workspace. Click the Apply Change Set button to delete your EC2 instance and key pair. Confirm you want to apply the change set. After the two delete actions are run, you will have a blank workspace and no more resources running in AWS. Congratulations! You've created your first resources with System Initiative. You learned how to create new change sets, add credentials and secrets, add components to the diagram canvas, configure components by setting their properties, connect components input and output sockets to dynamically configure them, and finally, execute actions and create resources by applying a change set. Thank you for trying System Initiative. If you have questions, come join us in Discord. We are happy to help. See you soon.